St. Augustine School has been around for literally 154 years, and the community uh, that's really behind the school uh, has been a lot of alumni uh, are still in the parish, and so uh, you know there's a long legacy of education here. And uh, so they step right up and uh, we raised about $300,000 in uh, about eight months uh, to make sure that the school stayed open in, in the fall of 2008. Well, we tell parents, you know, if you send your children to our school, wherever they are academically, they will improve. We prepare them for high school and high school is for life. We know that and uh, privileged to say that they've been able to go to different high schools of their choices. Coming to St. Augustine, I realized that while well, I'm going to high school, if I want to do well, I have to keep motivating myself. And the teachers here really help you. My social studies teacher, my science teacher, all my main core subject teachers, they're really, really good. You know, when that student finally, you know, the light bulb comes on and you can see that all of the effort that they've put in, you know, that they can actually see the fruits of their labor and the manifestation of it, and they have that, wow, I got it. You know, Mr. Riley, I have it now, and um, that is the most rewarding experience for me as a teacher. Robert was very well prepared. Um, St. Anselm actually starts their math at Algebra 2, which is unique actually for the city. St. Augustine's prepared them well because they adapted their curriculum just for the students that would be coming into a higher level once they got out of school, so his class had already done Algebra 1 before they went to high school. Every now and then there would be certain moments where like a teacher, when I would be struggling a little bit here at St. Augustine's and I would go and ask a teacher if I could see them and they were available after school. So it sort of helped me to sort of ask questions. Coming here, I learned that one of my biggest strengths were identifying like the different causes and like bringing them in and applying them to like the real world. Oftentimes our, our young people can hear of like from popular rap artists saying things like, you know, the purpose of life is to get rich or die trying. But here we have a moral foundation which really is about helping the children understand that they need to care for other people. That if you really want your life to have meaning, you have to care about and see how you can use your life to better other people's lives. We say come to St. Augustine and get a, a $9,000 education for a more affordable uh, 5100 That's because our staff is basically equivalent of schools that charge $9,000. Many of them come here because they know they will get what they are paying for. I could tell when I brought the kids to the school just to see what it was like that the teachers had the same dedication to the students that they did when I was here. Success Maker provides you with the measurement that you need to know where each child is every week. That's a program that I feel that has really helped us to grow academically. One of the things that we have uh, is a fencing program. Two days a week, actually one day in a week and on Saturday. I went to a lot of schools before and I never encountered fencing, so once I heard there was fencing, I was like, well, let me let me join because that's something different. You know? We have a, a chess club, you know, where they actually get to compete uh, in, in chess tournaments. You know, again, there's a chess foundation here in here in the city. Of course, the regular uh, sports, CYO sports like uh, you know basketball and cheerleading and uh, uh, flag football. So we have a, a number of different after-school and extracurricular activities for our children to to really get a, a well-rounded education. Where they study hard, they work hard, but they also can have fun and really build community together. Over the years, the curriculum just got stronger and stronger. That kept my kids here because I wanted to make sure that they were getting what they needed. And St. Augustine's has been able to do that for them. And I think actually put them further ahead than a lot of the other students that are going to high school, even out of the Catholic schools in the area. They're like a second family, you know. I come here and I feel like I'm at home. You get a foundation for life, both spiritual, academic, and moral but also uh, you have a community that cares about you. At the end of the day, um, you want to see you know, students having individual growth in their standardized test scores as well as your class overall. If you have the right curriculum and you know, the standards are high, those students who may have had some difficulties but are still putting in the effort will see that the effort pays off in the long run. And so over the past few years, we've been able to see, you know, the steady growth um, from class to class as well as for individuals that we've taught. The teachers, the principal, the pastor, look forward to being with the families here, to being with the children here, and to being with our church community. We really seek to provide a foundation for life for the kids, an academic foundation, a spiritual foundation, and a moral foundation. There's a saying, you know, people don't care how much you know till they know how much you care. At St. Augustine Catholic School, 
they will know how much the faculty, the staff, and all those involved in St. Augustine truly do care about every individual child who comes to St. Augustine.